time, engineers working on the Pokwasi interchange say they may not be able to complete the entire project by the October deadline. When government cuts sought for the commencement of the interchange, it was expected to be completed in April 2020. However, the project completion date was extended after it was expanded into a four-tier resident. Engineer Bimpon attributes this delay to what he says are technical challenges and problems associated with the COVID-19 pandemic. Nancy M. F. Jardosi was there in our report. A ground-breaking ceremony at Pukwiasi on the 3rd of July 2020 to begin the construction of the Pokwase interchange at ACP Junction in the Gao West Municipality of the Greater Accra Region. The interchange, according to Senior Minister Yao Safumafo, who represented the president, was to ease traffic and improve urban mobility of residents within the project zone. We are about to perhaps cut a sword of one of the most important interchanges in this country. In December 2019, President Okufuado visited the site where engineers assured him work will be completed in October 2020. Our construction work. So uh, what we have here are the piers, and that's what you can see, you know, in your view here. And then some, so these are some views. So when this is completed, when you're on the Accra Kumasi Road, this is what you see. You have the second tier the third tier and then the fourth tier. With barely two months to the deadline, the news team decided to take a tour the project site. Safety helmets on, reflectors and hand gloves, all in line with standard safety procedures at the site. Steadily, we climbed the stairs till we reached 22 meters above the ground. <laughs> We are actually standing on the tier 4 of this project, which is supposed to connect um, Awoshi to Kwabenya. Resident engineer Kwabena Bimpong said the project has faced several setbacks, including the coronavirus pandemic. Structures on the road, uh, hawkers and all these people was a major challenge. Now, the diversion of the road, this is a main, the main Accra Kumasi road. Over 40,000 vehicles ply this road each day. Now, to move these vehicles without causing major traffic is only going to take a miracle because, you know, the Accra Kumasi Road has always been a traffic, you know, and that is why we are constructing this road. So that was also, you know, the management of the traffic. When the COVID came, we decided that was sometime in March when there was a lockdown. The, we decided that nobody should travel because, you know, we have a lot of itinerant uh, workers. For about two, three months, we had a reduction of over 100 workers. And that really caused a major setback. He also revealed that they will not be able to complete the entire project by the stipulated October deadline. It's a challenge, but then we are determined to meet this deadline. As, but not to complete the entire project. Okay. Not to complete the entire project by you know, October. At least all the left hands or the ramps should be ready. You know, by during our visit, heavy vehicular traffic on the stretch was noticeable, but Engineer Bimpong was emphatic that after the project's completion, there will be free flow of traffic. When this project is completed, they will be on the right-hand side, which is the service road, okay? And that service road has a um, vast base. Okay. But again, at the end of the day, it is all about enforcement. The Pokwase interchange is said to be the second fourth year interchange in Africa after the Ebb Clotter interchange in South Africa.